Be making basics. What's going on YouTube? Be making basics back again with another dope video. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe because we're coming back to back with bangers. Today's video, I'm gonna be making a, a hard you know, trap beat using a lot of the features from the Logic Pro 10.8 update, okay? So we're gonna be, you know, using the sample sample alchemy plugin. We'll be using some sounds, the some of the new sounds, okay? We'll be also using the beat uh breaker, you know. Um so let's just go ahead and jump in. Um first thing I'm gonna do is start off with a basic beat, just get something going, and then we're gonna work on melody here. So I'm gonna use the quick sampler. I already have say sa sounds saved in here, and uh all you have to do is drag and drop the sound right here. And then go to this default area right here, put save as, and then all the sounds that you save will end up right down here. But um, like I said, I'm gonna start off with a basic beat and um, push P right there and click that. That's gonna end up giving us a clap. And we'll go with some hi-hats. I like using the step sequencer to like get my drum pattern started at least. Move this up to 64 steps. Okay, something simple, you know what I mean? Just to get, to get a rhythm going here. Um, I'm also going to go ahead and do a kick. So that's enough to get the, uh, at least a pattern going, uh, a basic drum pattern going. All right, so now what we're gonna do is pull up Sample Alchemy. And it's gonna be lit. So we'll start with a MIDI track, software instrument. And then this Sample Alchemy is like two down from the Quick Sampler. Boom, all right, so that's Sample Alchemy. I'll click this off right here. Uh, basically, we can drag and drop audio files here, or they have like some presets right here. So what I'm going to do is, like I said, we're going to use all of the new features here. So I'm going to go to the sound packs and we're going to go to hybrid textures. I'm just going to like scroll up here. Let's Okay, so we'll start with that. I'll turn on a C here. Um, I'm gonna push Command K for musical typing, so you can see what I'm doing. All right, if we turn C off, you feel me? It sounds different. So we'll use that, get that rolling. Try that again. Okay. I'm gonna quantize this. Forest Legato. All right, bet. So they have that going. That's the, that's the vibe we're going to roll with. I'm going to turn some of this stuff down. All 
right, so next thing I'm gonna do, and I'm actually gonna take this little part right here out. Next thing I'm gonna do is pull up the beat grader plugin, go to multi effects, beat, uh, beat, not grader, beat breaker plugin. So I'm gonna do some repeating. So that would be like a good like pause or break in the in the in the, in the verse or something like that. We can break it up with this beat breaker um, plugin here. I'm just gonna double this right here, and then we're gonna take that up an octave. Do this one as well. Do an octave low. Anyway, y'all, that's just like a basic video here, kind of showing, demonstrating, um, using some of the different new features of uh, the latest update. Make sure y'all subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next video, man.